Hi everybody, today I'm going to show you how to add wake word detection to any web app. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to the Pico Voice console and grab your access key. And then you're going to want to go to our blog post. Um, it'll be linked in the description down below and download our model. Uh, just click this button right here. It's going to be called porcupine underscore params <coughs> pv. From there, you're going to want to create a uh, React project using npx create React app. And I've named mine wake word and then I cd'd into that file. From there, you're going to want to make sure the correct dependencies are installed. I know that those are installed. What you're going to want to do is grab that path to your model file that you just downloaded and create it into a JavaScript file. This will convert it into a base64 string that your app can use. And now that that's saved, it'll be saved under porcupine underscore params.js. Now I'm just going to open that file. All right, and you'll see that it's there. Now we're going to have to go to the Pico Voice console and train our wake word. So I'm going to select English and we're going to do hey Jarvis and train. The platform that we're using is the web and download that. And you're going to see it's in this file right here. Okay. And now you're going to see that Hey Jarvis is there as well. Finally, we're going to create a voice widget.js within the SRC directory. So we're going to add a file and call it voice widget.js and within here we're going to write our function so the first thing you're going to want to do is import everything you need define those two files that we just put in and finally create an initialization button <clears throat> All right, and where it says access key, we're just going to want to replace it with our actual access key. <clears throat> and finally, we're going to have to modify app.js using a code found in our GitHub, which will be linked down below. All right, and then we just run with npm start. All right, so it's on localhost 300. I'm just gonna copy and paste that into here. And there we go. Hey Jarvis. And there we have it. Thank you for listening and visit Pico Voice AI for more tutorials.